7 o'clock and I uh, usually uh, sleep at that time but I couldn't sleep anymore so I decided to go for a swim in the lake I'm gonna go all in and, uh, and wash was so awesome. I really wanted to swim in the lake before before going back home. I'm gonna dress up, go back to my tent and put my lenses on because I can't see a thing. And uh, yeah, maybe eat some fruits and drink water and wait for the others to wake up. Obviously there is no, no mark or anything, so you just have to figure out things by yourself. But it's beautiful! Okay, so I'm so happy I'm working with Tina. We got lost, kind of, but Viking lost, so we found the path again. And we just saw that stone. And what is good about working with Norwegian people is that they know a lot of stuff. So the little cotton flowers we see everywhere, she told me that they used to make pillows out of them, which is like vegan pillows. And now this stone, you can see like writings on it. And so you were saying that it's an old trail. Yeah, there was an old trail here before. And when people needed to take a rest, they sat down on the stone. And apparently they wrote their names. Yeah. I'm gonna show you how to make very quick, healthy tacos on the trail. Beans, it's pretty cheap. It's full of protein, as you know. It's very filling. I've got these, and you can use iceberg salad as a taco. You just need to remove one big leaf. You can just put some beans in there. Mini carrots, and I love the name in Norwegian, it's gulrot. You put some cucumber in there. You can put corn, you can put whatever you have, bad mustard. Like that. So you can really put anything, whatever you have. Look at that! And you just eat it like that. Mm. You should totally put cumin in it. Yeah, quick, easy, healthy lunch on the road. We found a Viking place, kind of, <laughs> with uh, wild animals skins, a Walt Disney lamp. <laughs> Update on that party. <laughs> and now uh, the Viking is. <laughs> <laughs> Making wood. We now have candles. We found chocolate, but yeah, we're not taking this. I don't know yet. And there is a radio, baby, and it's retro radio. There is a huge spot for wild blueberries, tons of them, and we are picking them up for the breakfast tomorrow. And look at that. How awesome is that? We have a Viking home, we have a fireplace, we have white blueberries. Everything's gonna be all right. The owner of the cabin just arrived in the morning and he was like totally cool with the fact that we slept here. 